Number one thing that we always forget to do is make a reservation. Good morning everyone, happy Valentine's Day. I'm a little bit in a rush because I'm headed off to work right now. Connor and I both have to work and then we will have our Valentine's Day celebration after we go to work. But I just wanted to say happy Valentine's Day before I go to work. It's kind of chaotic in the morning because I have to like do all this stuff and then I need to take care of Samuel, kind of walk him a little bit before I go to work and then I have to pack my lunch and it's just kind of chaotic. So um, anyways, I'm not gonna like go on a ramble because I still have to get ready. Anyways, <laughs> happy Valentine's Day to you guys and um, I will see you guys later. Okay, so I'm in my car now and I just got off work and just waiting for the car to warm up because it's so cold outside. It actually snowed last night, so there's a little bit of snow on the ground. Um, but I'm on my way to go get a few more things for Connor for Valentine's Day. Um, I don't know about you guys, but I've been feeling like, I don't know, it just doesn't feel like Valentine's Day. And maybe that's because it's been raining a lot here and so it's not like this like love is in the air, it's like it's freezing. But also that could be love in the air because you're cuddling. I don't know. But anyway, so I am going to go get him a couple more presents today. Just probably like some treats that he likes and stuff and then gonna pick him up. So see you in a bit. Picking up the husband. Oops, locked the door, forgot to unlock it. Hello, my love. Hey, buddy. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day to you too. <laughs> you look beautiful. Thank you. Come on, Samuel. So we just got home and oh, we are gonna get ready for dinner tonight. We don't know where we're going, but we're gonna go somewhere because we realize there are not a lot of places here in our town. A lot of places in our town are like super, oops. <laughs> super like hole in the wall places like everything is hole in the wall there's like a, not a lot of um like known restaurants here where we live so yeah so we're just gonna kind of look around but we're first we're gonna get ready so we gotta look cute we gotta look fancy and yeah because we're not gonna be wearing under armor on our date so guys i'm taking like this really really hot hot girl out tonight um i actually met her on social media <laughs> <laughs> yeah so i gotta look good for her uh so i'm gonna be taking a shower and uh knocking off all my work day sweat and uh getting ready for the day <laughs> you spend my nights out at the bar All right, guys, so this is what I picked out. Uh, it's kind of casual, but also pretty fancy. Um, we, we decided that we want to go to a steakhouse just because who doesn't love steak? And uh, steakhouses can be really nice sometimes, and it's Valentine's Day, so we want to go, you know, somewhat fancy, but not hole in, the, hole in the pocket fancy. Yeah, so this is what I ended up picking out. So I hope, uh, you know, I can get a head nod from Brittany if she likes it or not. Brittany? All right, perfect. <laughs> I'm ready. Let's do it. Look guys, he's eating and we're about to go to a restaurant. This is what happens when you get married, guys. They eat all of the food. All of it. Like, they save none for you. They eat all the food. They can't stop snacking. Goodness gracious. Just, it's a never ending story of going to the grocery store <laughs> okay so we're sitting in the car connor is looking up another restaurant because number one thing that we always forget to do is make a reservation always we always forget and we actually connor actually called this place that we just went to um, but they didn't answer and so i was just like oh it'll be fine like we can just go and everything will be okay and of course like I feel like that was just a lie I told myself because we walked in there and we were like you know can we have a seat or whatever just for two and they were like okay well 
For two seater, the wait is three hours. <laughs> so now we're looking up another one, um, the Macaroni Grill, which is just down the street. And we called them and they didn't answer. So hoping that it's not because they're all so busy, but yeah, so our, our very last option is going to be Olive Garden, which is still a nice place, so, you know, Starting whatever. Starting to Romano's Macaroni Grill. Yeah, so Pack we'll see how this turns out. <laughs> how much I love you. How much I love you. not noir? <laughs> what are you drawing? Smiley face. And I'm happy. Are you gonna give it any hair? Mm. Good point. <laughs> Happy Valentine! <laughs> he thinks that he's gonna eat all of this without me. He's sadly mistaken. We're finished with our... Why does it look so bright? This lighting is so terrible. <laughs> but anyways, so we just finished our dinner and neither one of us is wearing a jacket and it is freezing outside. Like, <sighs> do you see that? cold and we're not wearing jackets <laughs> but we're almost to our car so that'll be good but we had a very good dinner and now we are going to go home and um, give each other our Valentine's Day presents okay so we are home and I am on my bed because me and Connor are gonna sh exchange gifts now I didn't wrap any of his presents so they're all hiding behind the pillow um, but he is somewhere, he's downstairs, and he said that he's coming up here, but he's taking forever. Also, here is Samuel. Happy Valentine's Day, Samuel. I love you. I love you so much. I'm ready. Sit down on the bed. Oh, I forgot to tell you, I bought some cookies. <laughs> They're the pink heart ones. Whoa! Happy Valentine's Day. Oh. <laughs> my favorite, you guys don't know this, but when I was little, my parents gave me the name, the nickname of turtle. And so I have like glass turtles, I have stuffed animal turtles, I have a necklace that's a turtle, like I have everything that's turtle. So I, I really love turtles. Also, I'm an awkward turtle, so it's basically me. Turtle? It's basically me. Samuel, you can't have it. You can't Samuel have it. really wants that. He really does. No, but I liked, I got this for you because it reminds me of high school. You remember when they'd have football games and... Oh, yeah. You know? That is like a, um, like a little package thing for football. Mm -hmm. Gridiron Girl? Yeah, Gridiron Girl. Yeah. Have a turtle-rific Valentine's Day. <laughs> Isn't that cute, Samuel? Isn't that cute? And just chocolates. I know you can smell the chocolate. Oh, I didn't make you a card. Well, I literally you. just put that card together. <laughs> right. Well, I have a card for you, but I'm going to give it to you whenever I give you the real gift. Okay. Aww. Did you read it? I'm reading it right now. <laughs> did you just think of this, or did you look it up? <laughs> <laughs> Let's just say I thought of it. Well, it's sweet anyway. Yeah, I loved it. That's sweet. The one that'll be on your real card is gonna is like thought out. It's thought I out. thought it, yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Got those. I, I had to add in a little extra, you know. Literally, guys, I bought these like a few days ago. We have like a whole pack of Laffy Taffy, so he just <laughs> threw those in there. <laughs> That's hilarious. Okay. Is that it? Yeah, that was it. Okay. Now my turn. I got Ooh. you just like a lot of random stuff because... That's not me. Um, you know I like it random. Yeah, because I just didn't. Oh, dang. <laughs> what do you got up? <laughs> I have a lot. <laughs> Give me the camera. Okay, guys. Okay, so your first gift, I'll just give you your first gift, okay? Okay. 
Okay. Here's your first gift. Oh, nice. I don't have to pay for these now. And I think these are, uh, yeah, they're splattering targets. So whenever you shoot them, it turns like a bright neon yellow wherever the bullet went. Yeah. So awesome. Thanks, baby. Mm hmm. And then also, got you this. Ooh. I've been needing a new mug. I feel like it's Christmas and not Valentine's. I know. I know. <laughs> I'm just getting you random stuff. <laughs> well, I like this. Okay. Um, are you ready for your next present? Yes. Some stuff for your garden. Oh. Those what are is this? Those, seed? those are onions. Oh. Guys, I'm gonna grow these this spring. And aren't they just so beautiful? And then also some red onions because I, I buy onions all the time and this would save a lot of money. And this is only $3 and there's like literally 50 onions in here. So this is going to my garden tomorrow. <laughs> Thanks baby. You're welcome. Also randomly I got you a Dr. Pepper because I know you <laughs> like Dr. Pepper. I'll take that to work tomorrow. And then last, just because sometimes your muscles hurt, I got you some bath salts. Oh, that's awesome. Muscle Relax Epsom Salts with essential, uh, essential oils. Ooh, lemongrass and ginger. That's like one of our favorite, baby. Mm-hmm. You know what we're going to be doing tomorrow? Taking a bubbly bath. Taking a bubbly bath. Mm-hmm. Well, if I would have known you were getting me like 12 things, I would have gotten you some more stuff. That's okay. Now I feel like I've underdone it. <laughs> well, buy me something tomorrow. Well, you still got something on the way. Don't you worry about that. Okay, that's okay. I like what I got. Okay, guys, so that was our Valentine's Day. This year was a little bit, like, low-key because he got off work a little bit late. Um, but that's okay. We still had a really great time. And I hope you guys all had a fabulous Valentine's Day. And for those of you who are away from your significant other or they're deployed or, you know, you just can't be with them, um... I hope you guys still had at least a nice Valentine's Day, you know, with some of your friends or something. And so always keeping you guys in my prayers. So anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and we will see you guys in our next video. Bye. Bye.